Yo, we are the Crane Couple, and we're back in Japan, in Shibuya. Yes. For Zhao Fishing Restaurant. It is a restaurant where you catch the freshest of fish, and they will prepare it the way you want. Yes. It's actually a really cool concept. <laughs> Come join us. Let's go. The way it works is you can buy fishing set, which is what we have. Yeah. Basically, a meal has appetizers, like we have Buddha and some sushi and some omelets that they just brought out to us. And a mommy. And uh, you also get fishing cards, which the fishing cards is what you'll use to essentially pay for the fish. Yes. So we have six between the two of us. And there's a variety of fish that you can get on the menu. And so whatever you catch, you have to give them the cards. There's things ranging from shrimp, prawns, small fish like mackerel, to larger stuff like sea bream, flounder, and even right now they have a really fancy one, yes. white trevally, which sounds really cool. Yeah. Uh, that's that one's fancy. That's 14 cards. That's 14 cards. Yes. And <laughs> for those who are really fancy, they even have lobster. So once you catch the fish, they'll ask you how you want it prepared. Right. And so. these are all the different types of ways that you can get it prepared. Yeah. There's a lot of choices, especially with the larger fish. So like say for the sea bream, you can get it sashimi, which would be nice because it's very, very fresh. Yeah. You can get them grilled, boiled, deep fried, breaded, or just like sauteed with delicious butter. And because these three specifically are bigger, you can actually do half something and then half something else. Joyce would probably like it more as a sashimi. Yeah. But I would probably like it more breaded or deep fried. Mmm. I really like the idea of the sea bream, but man, the trevally mm -hmm. is it's a fancy. big fancy fish. Might cost a bit, but I'll tell you. <laughs> maybe. You can buy more cards. I could get some cards, we'll see. <laughs> so here's one of two fishing tanks. There are a lot of fish. Oh my god. <laughs> These are where the larger fish reside. There are sea bream, and I believe the larger fish in here are the white trevally. Jeez. Y yeah. Y can you tell which ones are which, Brittany? Yeah. <laughs> There's a there's some larger fish in here for sure. I mean, if we got a trevally, I think that's plenty of food for both of us. I think that would be plenty of food for both of us. Um, I want to point out to this pool, they say that um, there's a different fishing rod. It's just a longer one. Mm. And you use bait for these guys. Yeah, they get hungry. Oh, get that big one that's going towards oh. the back right there. It's really pretty. Dang, this is cool. Ah. So here are the fishing rods longer ones along with the little bits of bait that you'll be using to hopefully catch something big oh man <laughs> down here on the first floor of the the uh, restaurant we've got a big variety of fish yeah there's some small fish well actually there's, there's, there's quite a bit <laughs> yeah there's, there's, a ton. there's quite a few things here but um here's some of the really big boys they have the white trevally here as well oh Oh, oh my gosh, they just got a, oh. they got a nice one. Some white trevally in this tank as well as extra large sea bread. Oh, extra large? Yeah. yeah oh my, oh yeah, that, there's some. That's 21 some big cards. Ones in there. Yeah, that's, that's just chonker right there. That, that's like good for like a, a whole table. Jeez. You know, look at, look at this guy. Oh, the, the flounders are down there too. Oh yeah. I didn't even notice them. <laughs> They're really sneaky. I have to point this out right here. There's a little size. There's a little size chart. Yeah, there's regular, large, and extra large sea bream. Oh. Extra large can be cooked up to four different ways. That's four how big they different, are. Four different. I mean, look at look at look at that one. Ooh. That's quite a few pounds. Look at that flounder. Oh, he's moving. He's kicking. He's kicking. So in this middle tank, they've got a lot of horse mackerel. Some other like smaller fish. It's so good size. Look at these little guys in here. Guys are cute. It's so small. Now these smaller guys, you don't need bait for. You just hook them. Yeah, you just try to hook on. So they told us. Hopefully, it's not too bad. Well, they even have like rockfish. Oh yeah, in they have here. a rockfish. I recognize in there. those. Just fishing in Southern California. Yeah. And then over here is the Japanese spiny lobster. Oh. Nine thousand yen. Oh boy. 424 tickets. 
quite a few tickets. That is quite a few. <laughs> and then we have some shellfish here. Uh, sea, I forgot the name of them. They're like uh, almost like giant sea snails in a way. Yeah. yeah. Over here, we have prawn. You like oh, shrimp? Look at them. They're just, just hanging out. There's like 380 yen or just like a ticket, I think. One ticket. Look at them just kind of scurry around. Yeah, again, these guys, like Brittany said earlier, the smaller guys, you don't need bait, you just hook on to them. Oh, they even have eel here. Look at those skinny eels. Oh, they eels. have eel too? Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff. Okay. What are you thinking of, Brittany? We probably want a big, bigger you, fish. We want a big fish to yeah. share. Before we fish, we're going to have a little bit of the appetizers. Yay. We have some tamagoyaki, the Japanese like egg omelet. Ooh, they just caught a nice one right behind they us. They did. <laughs> the timing is great. Yeah, so go ahead, Brittany, dig in. It's so big. Yeah, it's a big old piece. Wow. That's really good. It's very sweet. Yeah, it tends to be, mm -hmm. you might not think of it for eggs, but they do make it pretty sweet. Yeah. I also like how they cut it too. You yeah, it's so this. funny. Mmm. That That's sweet. pretty good. Mm -hmm. It's very tasty. Yum! Mm -hmm. I also have these guys. Oh, yes. We also have our little appetizer course of sushi. As if you didn't have enough seafood here already. I know. They give you, they give you oh. some straight up right here. My shrimp fell off. There we go. <laughs> it's okay. And have it as is. Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah. Can I put, I can put soy sauce yeah, in there. Yeah, put right? a little bit of soy sauce. Is it this one? one? Uh, I think so. Enjoy, Brittany. Ooh. Pretty, Pretty tasty. tasty. <laughs> you like it with the soy sauce? Yeah. Yeah, it adds a little bit of salt. They're banging the drum. Somebody won! Yeah, they got a nice one over there. I'm not sure what this one is. It had the tuna, and the tuna was really tasty. Mm. It got a little strip of the skin, but I, I, I don't actually know which, I don't know. which one it is. <laughs> I still don't know, <laughs> but it's nice and mild, so you might like okay. it. Mm -hmm. But now, we need a big fish. This is just a snack. <laughs> we need the good stuff. What do I use? Hmm. Maybe Look. some of this. It looks like another piece of fish. Yeah. Fish gets fish. Brittany's getting Ooh. hooked up. Use all that practice for the last year and a half. I know, we've been fishing a lot. <laughs> Actual fishing, not just in the restaurant. No. So Brittany's pretty familiar with this. All right, go all for right. those trevally. There's a lot of trevally down here. I want the trevally. So, big one right there. It's like the ones with like the dark gray top. I want that one. Oh yeah, that's a big boy. Uh, some of the little sea bream were thinking about <laughs> Yeah, it. I was like, no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, there, that this guy. guy. Yeah. This guy? No. No. The sea bream are hungrier than the trevally. Oh, man. There's so many. How do you target this one? There's like all these like sea bream. Yeah, I've only seen sea bream being catched lately. <laughs> oh, Ooh, no. Oh, speaking of sea bream, yeah. I got one over here. You're gonna end up getting a giant sea bream instead. Right. I mean, at the end of the day, what you get is what you get. Oh. Like that's what they got. Whoa. Come on, come on. Think about it. Just they see about it. it. They have you so many it. right there. They no. don't want it. Oh my gosh, they don't eat. <laughs> but if I put something else on Yeah, there. maybe maybe that's not the right bait. Let it be known that the white trevally is one of the smartest fish in the entire world, okay? <laughs> that's why we haven't caught one yet. Oh, Mr. Come trevally. Come over here. Come on. No, you're too small. <laughs> I can't have you, small, no, small bream. The small ones are the hungry ones. The yeah, they all hurt. Eat. Some light jigging motion. Oh, oh, the big, no, the big green thought about it. Oh, you, right Please. there. Think about it. No, oh, oh. he's so over by it. This is just like real fishing. It is, this, is, this is literally real fishing right here. They're having a hard time now too. Yeah, the, none of the fish want to eat, except for like the really tiny ones. It's almost like fishing isn't what people make it out to be on the, <laughs> the internet. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> Not yet, but we're still trying. We're Thank trying. You. We got special bait. Even the nice lady said, eh, they might not be hungry anymore. Maybe what you actually need to get is like a flounder, Brittany. 
the flounder. Oh, that one touched the line. Just taste it. I know you'll like it. Give that little bit. Just taste it. Ooh. Oh, they got a nice one right oh, there. Oh, nice. Oh, it's a nice sea bream. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no, it came off. Oh, I think it actually broke the hook off. It actually did. Come here. No. You, you, oh, you. You thought about oh, it. Oh, no. Big guy thought about one. it. Ah, I believe in you, Brittany. They know that I haven't fished in a while. Oh, <laughs> that oh. one crushed his nose. Try closer to the bubbles and the foam. Got a hang. Ooh. Oh, I thought that big one was coming yeah, over. Yeah, I thought to so it. too. I can't even see my thing anymore. A couple big ones coming over. Uh, it looks like some of the fish are starting to move over to your side of the tank. Oh, okay, come on. Got a small one over there. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, Ooh. oh. oh no, came off. Oh, oh no. The no. Because the lights went up for the birthday. <laughs> no. no. Oh, dude. I had one. It's cleared out, so we're gonna go on the right side. Watch, you're gonna get like a bite almost instant. Yeah, there's like extra strong jets here. Yeah, they they all hang out over here. Oh, oh, you got one! You got one! I got one! You got one! Oh, oh. oh. No. Came <laughs> off the line, Brittany. No. Oh, I'm hungry. hungry. I'm hungry too, fishies. Come on, you gotta eat. Oh, oh! Uh, I think I got uh, one. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah! There you go. Oh! oh. oh man, on. that's the second one. That was that was even larger than the yeah, first one. Yeah, when is that one? But like, I just pulled too. Like, I don't even pull too hard. Take three. Let's go. Let's go. You haven't hit the fish payout yet. They don't pull as hard as like when you actually go fishing. You got to really work for your lunch today, Brittany. I'm sorry. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh. Oh my goodness! Another one pulled off. What the heck? This is the one. This is it. I feel it. Brittany swapped out her rod and everything. Yeah, Fresh I have a bad shrimp. luck rod. So this is a good luck rod. Watch. Right. I'm ready. Right. Now. No, not yet. Oh. Ah. Oh, you he got like half of your. Uh, what the heck? He took half How of it. How are these guys eating my bait and not getting hooked? I don't know. You're throwing it on there and everything. Yeah. There's so many fish in this corner. One oh. of them's got to go for Somebody's it. Somebody's biting it. Somebody's biting it. Oh. Oh my there gosh. Bring him up. Bring him up. Bring him up. Right. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. He's a little on the smaller side, but he's your fish. Yeah. We will eat him we thusly. Nice, Brittany. Nice. Good job. <laughs> Hard fought. Hey, I got the. Ooh. ooh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good work. Ta -da! Very, very nice. Nice little sea bream. Looks good. Well, while we wait for Brittany's fish to cook, they brought out our tempura. Yeah. It's part of our set. The assorted mix of veggies, and it looks like there's a shrimp on the top. Yeah, there's a too. shrimp here too. It looks pretty good. Yeah. Oh, yours is oh coming my. apart. Don't drop them. That's literally holding on by a thread, <laughs> Brittany. Yeah. Let's dig in. Let's see. Dip it in this. Oh. Oh. There it goes. <laughs> now they say don't play with your food. Mm. Pretty nice. Sounds crispy. The batter is really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Steaming hot carrot. Anything is better if you deep fry it. True. I think it is. That is octopus. Yep, that is chewy. <laughs> Not bad actually. Oh, okay. It's a lotus it's a root. Lotus root? It's very dense. Oh. Oh. Right. It's not bad. No, the flavor is actually pretty but good. But it's like. You have to like. Kind of work to bite it down, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that how lotus root normally is? Uh, I can't say I've had a whole lot of lotus root, so I don't huh. know actually. We've got our fish. Brittany's sea bream is here, and it has been deep fried. Yeah. So, unfortunately, smaller size one, so we could not do a half and half. We really no. wanted to do half sashimi, half deep fry. Sorry, but 
He's he looks a small great. small boy, okay? We're going to have fun with him. Yeah, Let's it still looks really cool. He, he looks <laughs> awesome. The presentation is fantastic here. Yeah, the presentation is seriously fantastic. A restaurant like this is all about spectacle, right? Yeah. You want to dig in, Brittany? There we go. Let's see. Pretty tasty. Pretty good. It's very hot. It looks suitably meaty Yum. for a little fish. I like the deep fried batter that they use. Yeah. Here. Looks like it's got a fair amount of like pepper and everything in there. Yeah, got some seasonings in there. Very flaky. Yeah. It's a good looking piece of fish. Yeah. So I'll hop into some too. They have little sauces here. There's like a regular one and there's a spicy Yeah, sauce. there's a spicy one. I don't know how <laughs> spicy. It is, so you be careful. Let's dig in, guys. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> I can't grab any more. It's pretty tasty. It's pretty good. Mm. Clean white fish flavor right here. Yeah. Very, very straightforward. Very fresh, obviously. It's very fresh, so there's no like fishy flavor or anything. No, no. If your fish tastes fishy, it might not be very fresh. Actually, a little breamy right here is very tasty. Yeah? Yeah. You like him? I, I like him the more that I, I have little <laughs> bits and pieces of him. Yeah, we've named him Little Breamy. Yeah. Little Brimmers. <laughs> Hi, Little Brimmers. Thank you for your sacrifice today. Take this little oh, piece yeah. of Oh, yeah. Look at this. That's a nice looking piece of fish right it's a here. a nice piece right there. Oh, yeah. Ooh, I think that was a bit with some more skin. That was a good bit. Yeah, the skin is nice, yeah. right? Yeah, the batter is like super flavorful. Yeah, I will say, man, you know, I'm sure he's great at sashimi or grilled or anything like that, but their deep fried batter is really good. Yeah. <laughs> Final thoughts on Zhao Fishing Restaurant, Brittany? Little Bramy is tasty. He is. <laughs> yeah, actually, it's very tasty. It was actually pretty fun. Yeah. It, it wasn't smooth sailing in the fishing department. Yeah. I'm really worried about catching a fish. Maybe go to the first floor, guys. Yeah. I, I think it's a little easier right there, too, because they're all clustered up. Yeah, there's more, like, fish kind of clustered over there. Mm -hmm. It was a fun and entertaining and unique experience, It's, it's sure. a very fun experience and fun atmosphere, too. Yeah. The only downsides I really see to the restaurant are, well, Mainly the price. Yeah. It is on the pricier side. It's 4,000 yen per person. So that's about how much in US dollars? About $30. Yeah, just about US. the time of filming this. It wouldn't be like a ton of food. Yeah. So if you're really hungry, you might end up spending a little more than you might expect to. And you can get more tickets. Yeah, you don't have to be limited to that. You can you can get whatever you want and then pay for it. Yeah. yeah. The other issue could be, well, if the fish feel like biting. I think it's mainly an issue with the second floor fishing yeah, pool. Yeah, because they have so much space to kind of swim around. They kind of do whatever they yeah, want. Yeah, they can be more picky about it. You yeah. Know? We definitely noticed during our time fishing that for the most part, it was all the small, regular size even, which yeah. is definitely it wasn't the largest fish. No. So one guy did get a very large one, though. Yeah, somebody did get the large one, but that was the only one I've seen. But it was a good time. So if you're into fish and you're into fishing and you want one of the most unique restaurant experiences around, check out Zhao. They have a few locations here in Tokyo. They do. Mm -hmm. This is the Shibuya branch and it was very popular here on a Saturday. Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. We are the Crane Couple. Don't forget to like and comment and let us know what you felt about Zhao Fishing Restaurant here in Tokyo, Japan. Yay. Would you come here? Would you fish up your own meal? Would you? Stand around for an hour hoping for a white trevally to hook up. How do up. you feel about Lil Breamy? Comment below and let us know. Subscribe and ring the bell for more of our Japan Trip Part 4 content. We live streamed almost all of it on Twitch, twitch.tv slash couple. Feel free to follow us over there and check out our adventures both at home and around Southern California, Yay. Vegas, and even around the world. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye!